Yeah, good night and this your boy Bucky got it and Bucky always got it I'm not reading from the paper I just will be speaking straight directly from how I feel within some person is gonna be happy with this video and some won't but that's life you know but um it takes people like me a young entrepreneur persons who are in the media to shed light on things that um you know you may not hear or uh, you might probably hear on the street and don't really care no further now mother's day you know it's tomorrow and um, i just want to big up all the mothers them for me personally you know being a mother it's a blessing which mean that you can go forth and multiply so i really respect female and a whole you know and that's, that's that's something awesome you know they are they are a lot of young females out there along with mature females want to become a mother and for whatever reason god haven't blessed them with that as yet and i'll say to you you know keep trying keep praying and someday your prayers will be answered you know with that said let's get into a little um, <clears throat> depth of this video and i want to share and subscribe to my youtube channel right thank you very much in advance for that mothers now you know it's, it's mother's day and there are some fathers out there trying to reach out to these mothers and it's difficult you know and you know i want these mothers to look within themselves you know and understand that co-parenting is a key to the upbringing of our children and we love to stress about the children are our future but we are often guilty of hurting the same future that we boast about you know some others you know yeah if, if, if these um, fathers daddies or whatever you want to call them you know reach out to you just answer the phone you know they might just want to tell happy mother's day maybe they might want to um, make amends you know maybe they might want to fix whatever is broken you know and for your mothers who love to use your children to spite the fathers you all need to stop it you know because um you know we i had a, um, a a good conversation today with a good friend of mine i was debating you know about you know children and you know how support men goes and stuff like that you know and you know when you look at support men support men is not just giving the child money monthly weekly bi-weekly whatever you know when you look at support men you're speaking about you calling the child your child calling you you know i get so many stories from um fathers who are affected and, and you know i i could see and feel some of their pain you know there are fathers out there who are reaching out to the children and the mother is stopping them some mothers go as far as um blocking them on whatsapp blocking them on facebook you know and taking away the child phone so the father can't talk to them you know come on mothers come on mothers you know some of your mothers grow up without your father and it's like you you don't realize that you're doing the same to your child so it seems comfortable because it's almost like you know no better because you grew up without a father so it's like hey I go up without the father, I'm doing fine, I have done fine with myself, so I'm going to do the same for my child, you don't need your father, you know, and that's something wrong, you know, because at the end of the day, the child may not be affected now, but later on, what about when he or she is in school, and they ask him, you know, where's your daddy, how come daddy didn't come to your graduation, how come daddy didn't come to your council, you know, some of you have your children saying, oh, I have two fathers, you can't have two fathers, you only have one father. Whether he's your adopted father or your biological father. Right? That's your father. That's the only reason why you see a father come into place. Some persons, because their boyfriend or husband looking after um, their child, they work out well to help with the father. You know? 
and um, sometimes persons want to count the, um, the guys them money it's like okay you're working for this amount of money you got to afford to give my child this amount of money you know and then it, when you buy stuff for your children they still want X amount of money you know and they won't buy this stuff but mothers these children are speaking out you know these children are speaking out today I encounter a situation and I just smile to myself a child don't know her father phone number and she's about um, I think 12 years I think it's about 12 years and she don't know her father number how could you don't know your father number at that age so if anything happened to you and you want to reach out to your father you can't and is that thing that mothers have to like we have to go back to the drawing board you know and make sure that your child know your father's number make sure your child call the fathers for father's day for for christmas for his birthday call him on a weekly basis to see the, what's up mothers stop preventing the fathers from bonding with their children it is not right it is not right and yes they are bad fathers and this video is not speaking about those bad fathers in the next episode of bucky got it we'll speak about them what we're speaking about here is the fathers who are trying to reach out to their children and your mother has prevented it and i'm appealing to you this mother's day 2019 right to look at yourself forgive move on let bygone be bygone but you to sing it you know they think sometimes the children said to the fathers and you don't even know you'll be you'll be surprised we we can't choose for anybody yeah you may not like my girlfriend right but does it mean that what you're gonna not allow my child to have a relationship with me because you don't like my girlfriend you know everybody deserves a second chance persons go to jail and come back out and live in better you know if you look at the bible a lot of these men who are who, who are in the bible fall but they rise again jonah and the whale daniel in the lions then look at judas i'm saying that we are human and we're going to make mistakes but at the end of the day we have to find within themselves some persons still down there trying to get back to society because we're keeping them down mothers it's mother's day and you i'm appealing to you to do better by your child and by the father do better and after mother's day is father's day so in the next episode i'm gonna speak about you know how to move on and let their children call their fathers and that day also but we're speaking about mother's day tonight come on you know we're living in a society where too many children you know are, are, are being brought up by their mother alone or their father alone or their stepfather or father-in-law you know and the father that in his life and not in her life your mother's doing a lot of crazy things you know women have to be strong because the kind of things that you put women through trust me if we don't strong we we'll either end up in the crazy house and the psyche water or jail or maybe dead but sometimes it's our friends these who actually talk to us and tell us calm down and try to let us just figure out a lot of things that you all do it is not nice come on mothers it's a blessing that you was able to reproduce a child needs both parents because things that he or she would not want to tell you they need their father right so you know making this video too long and like i said subscribe to it you know and share it because I know a lot of fathers are being affected. You know, a lot of good fathers out there are going to do a lot of good things for these mothers tomorrow. And, um, you know, like, um, the, the, some of these fathers are going to go to church. 
They're gonna take out some of them to dinner, to lunch. Some of them gonna get breakfast. And that's awesome. Because like I say, woman, you know what I mean, is the, is, is, is the creation. You know? You are the empress. You are the reproduction. You carry a child for basically nine months. Yeah, it could be a little more, it could be under, but it's basically nine months. But you cannot continue to keep the children from the father. Be that mother that your mother wasn't. Be that mother that you are to be. Be that mother that the Lord wants you to be. And you can only do that if you can forgive and move on. Thank you for watching this video. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. And look out for more episodes from Bucky Garrett and Bucky Hasgarrett. Over and out.